What is going on guys, welcome back to the Life is Strange, we're continuing where we left off in the last one. So I think we're going to go make our way in through the door if she hasn't picked a lock already. It doesn't look like she has though. <laughs> uh, pipe bomb, alright, we'll make it a pipe bomb, nice. Take it easy on the door, Chloe. Let's try this instead. Boom! Literally. Yes! Time to blow shit up! <laughs> if you'll light the candle. This is so cool! Uh, run. Get ready to haul ass. It that worked. was so fucking cool! <laughs> oh, we are toast! Oh no. Here comes the whole Arcadia Bay Fire and Police Department. Uh, so what should we do? Well, hold on. If I go in, can I rewind? And then be inside? Like, we've done this before. Um... There we we'll go, we're in, and we haven't had to use the pipe bomb. This ancient door is no match for Max the Magician. <laughs> Let's unlock it. If I can get this bastard open, she can't cheat with a rewind. <laughs> oh, this is bullshit. Fuck you, door. Welcome to my domain. You are magic. I have no clue how the hell you got in there, but you did it, sister. The company I keep. Now, let's find what we want and beat it. My powers only go so far. Man, I can see why the principal locks this room up. Fancy faux art crap. He must want everybody to know he has money, but no taste. How can you trust somebody who has a fucking bronze bird in his office? I'm glad I was expelled. Yes, if only the principal had a Monet or Picasso, you'd still be a Blackwell. Eat me. I'm gonna pill for the papers on this ugly ass desk. Okay, sure. It's ugly, but damn, is it a cozy chair. This is your chance to truly get all deductive and shit, Sherlock. Find us some clues about Rachel, or Kate, or Nathan. Anybody. I'm on the case. Let's have a look around, shall we? Uh, Alright. Uh, it's a bit dark over here. Aha, uh -huh, we can turn on the lamp. Uh, let's uh, see what Warren's saying. Um, uh, did you blow up the lock? Uh, oh, please, I just wanted to see if you knew your explosives. <laughs> and to see your incredible artwork. Okay. Uh, is there any more lights we can turn on? Light switch, maybe? No. All right, what's here? I certainly can't use this. Search here. This pretty much sums up Kate. Shy and sweet. And in the wrong place. Uh, if you guys want to go ahead and read that, uh, you can go ahead and pause and do so. I'm not going to read that one. Only two more files to go. I don't think there's anything else over here, so we'll, uh, we'll turn off the light. Wow, sir. This will so not come in handy. I'd drink too if I was the principal of Blackwell. So he's hiding booze, eh? And nothing here. I wonder if it's the uh, the principal guy who's um who's got folders on everybody. What we've been seeing in the last few episodes. Could be. It would make sense he have folders on everybody. Rachel doesn't seem so troubled based on all this. But there's not much here about the police investigation. If you guys want to go ahead and pause and read that one, go ahead and do so. I'll just uh, make it nice and easily readable for you. Man, I don't blame the principal for expelling Chloe. Bad Chloe. <laughs> Let's have a look in here. There you go. Uh, I guess it tells you why she also probably got expelled there somewhere. 
Uh, it's, yeah, I just read it there at the bottom. Uh, see attached police report. Yeah, that's probably got her expelled. <laughs> oh, I, I don't. I didn't mean to jump out of that. I think Let's still nab this more. last file, Sherlock. Man, I don't blame the principal for expelling Chloe. Bad Chloe. I don't know. I think we got all of them actually. Let's search here. Weird. This asshole has a spotless record. Yeah, his mommy and daddy's probably paying for that. It's uh, Nathan who owns... His family owns the joint, so... Like I'm not going to read my own personal file. <laughs> if you're going to go ahead and read Max's uh, file there, uh, go ahead and pause and do so. This file is going to be so spotless, I'll projectile vomit. <laughs> I probably uh, he's, he's bribing his mommy and daddy to get her spotless as well to be honest I have to make sure Warren doesn't have a criminal background doesn't look like he does he's just got a brief summary and that's uh, that's it no notes I think we found everything in here I should go join Chloe now alrighty oh, what we got here so, Nathan Prescott's dad is a bully, too. Shocker. Yeah. I'm not shocked by that at all. You're not so tacky up close. Oh, there's a letter here. What's on the letter? That is so cool that my signature actually counted. Go, Miss Grant. Yeah, oh, I was I was press A there. I press X for some strange reason. Uh, if you guys want to go ahead and read that one as well, uh, you can pause and do so. I'm not gonna. I'll read them when I edit. So uh, if there's anything interesting in there, I do quickly scan read them. But I didn't really scan read that last one. Anyway, let's uh, speak to Chloe. Max, you better come check out these files. Nathan accuses Rachel of bringing drugs on campus. And my step troll went along because he thinks Rachel was a bad influence on me. Assholes. If David is teaming up with Nathan Prescott, that's a bad sign. Nathan yeah, Prescott the third. Ooh, he's so money. And you know the Prescotts dropped major bank to bury Nathan's real file. Look, it reads like a rap sheet. Bad grades, teacher complaints, secret probation. But I was expelled? At least Nathan was finally suspended. Check out that note. Open it. It's just some crazy drawing. It's not a drawing. Look. Rachel in the dark room. Rachel in the dark room. Over and over. That's it. That's fucked up. What does this even mean? Nathan is truly psychotic. I know he has something to do with Rachel missing. Whoa, listen to this. David M. always asks what's going on in my head. David M. always helps me follow those he follows. <sighs> it's pretty cryptic. No, it sounds like they formed some sort of weird team, the Super Hebros. Jesus. David was stalking Kate, hassling me, and now we know he was all over Rachel, too. Oh, we are so going into his garage files. Plus, I'm getting a little paranoid in here. We got our info. Let's bail. But maybe we shouldn't leave without a gift. No, you are not taking the cozy chair. Max, do your powers include mind reading? Or did you just rewind because I tried to steal the chair? <laughs> Shit, I'm confused. It's the powers of best friendship. I know how you roll. We should definitely get out of here. We pressed our luck enough. Hello, what have we here? Holy shit! Jackpot! Cha-ching! Wow, sir. That's a lot for the handicapped fund. Dude, there's $5,000 here. I could pay Frank back tonight. This'll chill him out after our knife showdown yesterday. Are you gonna make a big issue out of this? Or just rewind and take the greenbacks for yourself? I hope you do that instead of lecturing me. Okay, so we have need to make the decision here. Uh, so leave the money or steal the money. Oh. So, uh, one thing with this is if we take the money, the principal knows we've been in here and somebody's nicked his money. 
if we leave the money, he doesn't know we've come in and nicked files. Just files have gone missing. That can easily happen. Let's leave the money. You really want to take money from the handicapped fund? I know you need to pay Frank back, but... I've got my power to protect you, right? There's a lot of power in that horse-choking wad of cash. But yes, Moral Max is right again. I guess. Let's get the hell out of this office, Morg. I know that money would have helped Chloe and me. Yeah, but... If we took it... All's what's gone missing right now is files. That's that's it. Um, like they can easily go missing, like, file and errors, stuff like that. Like, things like that can go wrong. But if, like, money disappears out of his draw, yeah, that's, uh... That's a lot. That impish look scares me. Care for a midnight swim? The Blackwell pool is ours. Swimming? You want to take that risk now? It's been a cray week. You didn't let me take that money to pay off Frank, so if he pops a cap in my skull, at least allow me to have a little carefree fun for a few minutes. Splish Splash? You're right. <laughs> we hella deserve it. Splish Splash. Did you actually just say hella? I think I'm a good bad influence on you. Hey. It's great just to relax. Swimming is relaxing. For me, it's relaxing. For some people, it probably won't be. Why do you find swimming really uh, relaxing? Don't think I've been swimming anywhere in, We're in the otters a while later. now. Big fucking deal. I want that heated water. We still have to play it cool, okay? I still go to school here. You can own this hellhole once you figure out your rewind power. Chloe is so psyched for girls' night out, so I better follow her evil plan. Alrighty. Boys or girls? Uh, boys' locker room or girls' locker room? Um, isn't everybody curious about the uh, the opposite sex? So uh, let's go boys' room. Boys, of course. Figures, perv. <laughs> Let me check to see if the pool's heated. I guess somebody forgot their Blackwell spirit. No way am I touching Zach's jersey. Zack is really careless. Doesn't he know what happens when I'm around? <laughs> if you guys want to go ahead and read those, uh, you can. Pause. Betty developed that in Jefferson's class. But why? Come on, Max. Are you buying that he, uh, he likes you? Yeah? Some poor hipster lost their vape. Huh. It's okay for Nathan to be hooked on these drugs, right? I think we've uh, explored just about everywhere. Probably not. Sex me up, really. Boys' locker room is right. It's probably what, not much different to the girls' uh, locker room. Minus the graffiti, probably. Huh, it's nice to know Victoria loves something besides herself. <laughs> Welcome to 1950. I bet you do. Yeah, nothing really, uh, too interesting. 
This one is almost empty. The guys must like their pink goo. Max Caulfield, Moral Avenger. Or Self-Righteous Hypocrite. Look, we got some more graffiti behind the door. Bros will be bros. <laughs> Max, try to find the light for the pool. I want to see the sharks. Otters don't like sharks. They bite. So do I. Hit that light. Alrighty, where's the light gonna be? Um... I think this is the, uh, the girls' locker room. It actually doesn't say anything. Some showers. Uh, as you come in, so you can wash all the chlorine off. Hello, gorgeous. <laughs> you wish, Max. You just look like a snoop. <laughs> Ooh, pink goo. I see why everybody brings their own soap. Sorry, Rachel. She really did print out a lot of those flyers. This isn't a desperate cry for attention or anything. I'm pretty sure we are in the girls' locker room now. Yeah, I'm guessing by the amount of toilets. Well, we care, dickhead. I hope so, friend. Let's see if the girls' uh, locker room is any different. Where does that other sock go? Looks like Brooke wants to go to the drive-in with Warren. Hmm. Too bad, I think uh, Warren's got his eyes on somebody else, I think. Those are some musty-ass old shirts. Yuck. Those look like the most cozy, comfy towels in towel history. Want. Flippers in a swimming pool? Are they training Navy frogmen here? <laughs> ah, Victoria's locker. Let's have a look in there. So, Victoria's secret is selfies. Go fuck your... No. Jefferson said, don't confuse art with the artist. These are cool shots. <laughs> well, she's actually, uh, got some morals. The wit. It burns. Yeah, so th the difference between the guys and the girls' locker room... A bus ticket? Was she going to run away? Like Rachel Amber? She could have. Yeah, so the girls' room's a little bit more stocked. There's a little bit more... It's a little bit more cleaner, I guess you could say. If I could rewind back to the 1940s, I'd get in serious trouble. But uh, yeah, it doesn't look like the switch for the lights is in here. I was just curious, just to see what the difference was. To see if they had a different art design. Uh, I think I saw a door here. Lifeguard. Ah. Oh. In case I run out of air, I know where to come. <laughs> there has to be a control panel for the lights around here. Halloween pumpkin? Aw, look at the baby Halloween pumpkin. <laughs> Anything over here? in here. Yes, we get it. Otters. Good dummies. Don't even think I'm going to make a move on you. <laughs> ah, here we are. Now I have the power over light and death. Switch it on. Oh, here she goes. Quite a good dive. Time to do or dive, Max. Oh, 
<laughs> oh yeah, baby, feels like a hot tub. Too bad you made me feel like the queen of assholes because I wanted that cash stash. Hmm. Tell me you're not gonna stand there watching me like a zombie. Don't you dare! Come stop me, hippie! Okay, you asked for it. I was gonna say, where are they getting the swimming costume from? And I just realized it's, uh, it's just the underwear. Why, look, an otter in my water. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> you are so obvious. And I still get freaked out by that movie, so stop. I can't even watch any of those shark shows. <laughs> I'll just rewind and harpoon you. Otter's revenge. Cheater. <laughs> yeah, you wouldn't know about that. <laughs> I wish Rachel was here. She would totally love being in here at night. Wish you guys had met each other. We will. With all this stuff going on, I'm starting to think everything is related. And I want to find out for Kate's sake. She almost died today. Your power is changing everything, Max. Especially you. I can already tell. You're not so chicken shit anymore. Thanks, girlfriend. You know what I mean. You're becoming like this force of nature. More like luck of nature. Come on, my power failed trying to rescue Kate. Maybe I'm just stumbling back and forth in time. For what reason? You didn't stumble when you saved me, Max. Uh, what if I had, thanks to you? Uh, thanks to you. Not that time. But that's because you were there to kickstart my power. So it's time to start moving forward in time. And we're obviously connected since without me you would have never discovered your power, right? Absolutely. Absolutely. You make me feel like I know what I'm doing. And you make me feel like I have a reason for still being in Arcadia Bay. I hope so. Stop being so goddamn humble. You're like the smartest, most talented person I've ever known. More than Rachel Amber? Dude, I'm not her groupie, okay? <laughs> and I'm sure you have Blackwell bros all over you. Like Warren. Yeah, the bro killer. Warren is nice. A oh, gross. Um... Warren is nice. Warren is nice. <laughs> nice? Ouch. That means friend zone. No, he's really cool. It was so sweet when he stood up to Nathan. But I haven't told him about my rewind power. No worries. Once you get over yourself, you're going to make the world bow. As long as you're there with me. Don't look so sad. I'm never leaving you. Now I'm getting cold in here. Because we're yapping instead of attacking each other, otter versus shark style. I uh, think I've had my pool experience for the year. Let's jump. Let's call it a draw. I'm gonna freeze my ass off when I get out. I feel like we just went swimming in Chlorine Bay. You look cute with your hair soaked in chemicals. Thanks. You would know. Hi! Hide. Well. Uh, where can we hide? Uh, in one of the fire install? It's hide. Move, Max! Don't waste your power on getting busted! Is this a good place to hide or do I need to go hide somewhere else? There's nowhere else ready to hide. We have to go now. 
Where do you want me to go to? Through the exit. Okay. I guess this is where we had to go. Let's leave this room pool. Are you shitting me? Oh no. Oh, it's step douche. Dude, hide! Like when we were kids. I could use my power, or just look for a hiding spot, or both. Where are they? It's hiding Hello? here. Hopefully, we're good. Just please don't come up to the end stall. Please don't come up to the end stall. Hello? Anybody there? Better not try any Halloween pranks after today. I'm serious. Right, so he's in that. I heard room something now. Here. And um, Chloe's Who's in here? there. I got, I got a flashlight and a stick. <laughs> By any chance, are you the stick? <laughs> uh. Oh, I know if he comes back out. Sounds like maybe he's opened the door. It sounds like he's maybe he's left. It's a good hiding place. It's there. Speak to Chloe. Can't. We are so invisible. Let's bail. Apparently, you can. I did double tap here. There. I'm not sure if we accidentally skipped over something. Wait. Turn around. They're coming. We have well. to find another way out. Oh, this is bullshit. <laughs> Jump you over can't the wall. go back to your dorm now. You're a Blackwell fugitive. Crash at my place tonight. You want me to crash where the Blackwell security officer lives so I'll be safe? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Into the car. Get in. Hopefully you didn't yes, see the car. So are. 